Welcome to our tech tutorial. Today, we're tackling a question that many developers encounter when working with mobile applications. Our viewer is looking to open Google or Apple Maps on iOS using Meteor.js. They mentioned that while they successfully used a specific code for Android, it doesn't work the same way on iOS. Let's dive into this challenge and explore how to make it work. Welcome back to another technical video. Today we're going to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution for you. Now, remember to stay just a little bit crazy like me, and hopefully you get to that resolution. Now let's continue on. To open Google Maps or Apple Maps on iOS using Meteor, we need to use a different approach than we do on Android. iOS requires a specific URL scheme. For Google Maps, we can construct a URL using the hdl.google.com map slash search, ache one and query its format. This allows us to pass the latitude and longitude directly. For Apple Maps, we can use the Maps URL scheme. The format is Maps 00 keypulks, followed by the latitude and longitude. Now let's implement this in our Meteor application. We will use the window.open method to open the Maps app with the constructed URL. Finally, ensure that you replace address long lat with the actual latitude and longitude values you want to use. This will allow the app to open the correct location in the Maps. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To open Google Maps on iOS using Meteor, you can use a simple code snippet. Just use the window.open method with the appropriate URL format. For more details, you can check out the reference link provided. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To open Google Maps in iOS using Meteor, you can use a geolink. This will prompt users to open the location in their preferred Maps app. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To open Google Maps in iOS using Meteor, first add the in-app browser plugin. Then create a variable for the latitude and longitude. You can use the window.open method to launch either Apple Maps or Google Maps. And that's it guys. I hope this video has helped you find that solution that you're looking for. If it did, please hit the subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it. And until next time, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.